Yes, I would like to order flowers for tomorrow for Valentine's Day. Okay, what's your name, sir? James Maritato. This is going to be good. Hey, listen, um, do I get a discount on those? Because me and my wife have been together for 20 years. And, uh, you know, some other stores are doing that, I heard. Oh, yes? Where? Where? Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, I'm actually having a brain fart right now. But, you know, I heard they were doing it. So if I get a discount, it may work out for you, too. Sir, this is a joke, and I'm like, you have a lot of orders on the show. Do you want to order flowers or not? No, it's not a joke. It's not a joke. I definitely want to order flowers. I'm sorry. I apologize. Okay. A dozen? I just told you I was with my wife for 20 years. A dozen. It's a half dozen. I can't do it. What are you, are you out of your mind? <laughs> I'm being serious. I have a dozen. 20 years. I'm going to get her a dozen flowers? Also, do me a favor. Um, she works in the school. I will give you the address. Um, I want to see if I can get, get them delivered by, like, I would say, 2 o'clock, say, if possible. All right, um, only problem is, like I said, she works at a school, so I don't want them to arrive when she's not there. And honestly, this makes me look good. It's half the battle. The roses show up, all the other teachers see it, you know, makes me look good. She gets very excited. You know, it's like a gimmick, you know what I mean? Valentine's Day. There are what? It's a gimmick. It's a gimmick. That's what Valentine's Day is. I send them to the school instead of my house because it's going to make me look good. And if I look good, maybe at the end of the night, I get a little push-push, <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> so, so if I get a bit, if I get it, I think he f hung up on me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think I better, uh, I think I better find a new flower peddler. Should I call him back? <laughs> uh, shut that off.